Hey folks, how are you? Welcome back to my channel. So guys, in today's video, we are going to see the top 4 projects of Elon Musk, which is going to change the world. So guys, the video is going to be very, very interesting. So please watch the video till the end. So the first one is Starlink. At present, all of us are using internet with wires. By spending some crores of money, we are getting optical fiber cables through oceans to connect the internet throughout the world. But after reaching these cables to their country, again to spread these cables throughout the other places of the country, it will be very expensive. So to reduce these expenses, internet companies will spread these cables only for the cities and towns because the population is more in cities and towns than villages and they will get more profits. So this is the reason why village people will not get the internet connection and similarly cables will not be spread onto the mountain regions due to more expenses and less population. So this is the reason we are having less internet coverage in hilly areas. So to resolve all these problems and to reach the internet to every corner of the world, Elon Musk started Starlink project. This company will not provide internet by cables. It can connect the internet throughout the world by satellite and the users can use the internet from satellite. So because of this we can provide internet to villages and mountain areas and to every corner of the world. And the process is they will send these satellites through rocket and they will keep these satellites 550 km above height from earth. And every satellite can cover 1000 km radius on earth and can send their signals. These signals will come to the antenna which is installed on the top of the house and it is similar to like DTH antenna. And from antenna through voice we will get these signals to the router and the people can use the internet. And till now 1500 Starlink satellites are launched and to cover all over the world we need 12,000 satellites and to launch these many satellites it will take 10 more years. And maybe by 2030. We can send the internet to every corner of the world and at present these Starlink internet services is available in some of the countries. And already many companies are trying to develop this project. But to launch the rocket is more expensive in those days. But whereas Elon Musk is having SpaceX, due to this with very less expensive he is launching the satellites. And at present the internet speed with Starlink is 150 Mbps and he is telling that the speed will also increase in future. And second project is Solar City. At present mostly we are getting electricity by burning coal and due to this pollution is also increasing. And to reduce this pollution, Elon Musk started Solar City by using solar energy he is trying to produce electricity. And in future producing electricity from coal is more expensive than solar energy. And due to that we can provide electricity to consumer for very less expenses. And in 2016 Elon Musk bought Solar City company from his two cousins. Actually, he only given the suggestion to start Solar City, but due to the losses of company, he bought it. Mainly, Solar City is working on two concepts. The first one is solar leasing concept. Actually, if we want to install solar panels on the top of our houses, we need to bought it. But whereas Solar City is providing solar panels for the free of cost for who they wanted to install solar panels, but they wanted to make an agreement, and the agreement is Solar City will install solar panels on the top of the owner's house. But for that he is not going to pay a single rupee. But the electricity which is producing by the solar panel for that he need to buy the electricity. So this is the agreement from the solar city. And obviously the owner will accept the agreement because it is very less expensive than normal electricity. And due to this the electricity bill will also be very less. So this is all about the solar leasing concept. And after this they started another concept which is called as Tesla Powerwall. This power wall is a battery which can store the electricity and the capacity of the battery is very high. If once you recharge this power wall battery, it can produce enough electricity which is required for household for one day. By using solar panels, we can use the electricity only during the daytime. But by using Tesla power wall, we can store this electricity into the power wall by charging the battery so that we can use it during the night times too. Or else we can use it like an inverter when the power gone, we can use this power wall. And for commercial building rather than using fuel generators we can use more capacity power wall batteries and Elon Musk constructed a large battery in Australia. And the third project is Neuralink. He collaborated with 8 people and started this company and by using this the problems which is related to the brain or disabilities so to overcome these problems by using brain to control the mobile or computers he wanted to develop this technology. So for that from different universities he recruited the top neuroscientists. And they all together are developing this technology. By using this technology, they will insert a small chip into the brain. And by using this chip, the diseases which are related to the brain like spinal cord injuries and paralysis like this, the body parts which are stopped working. So by using this chip, we can try to start working on these body parts. And similarly by using this, we can control mobile phones and computers without hands. At present, this technology is in developing stage, they are testing on animals. 
Recently they tested on a monkey. The monkey which you can see on the screen they inserted two chips in the brain. Every time it plays the game correctly it can produce the food through a pipe. So they designed a program like this. At the beginning they given the training how to play with the joystick and later without joystick they started the game. Then this monkey played this game with the brain. That means the way how the monkey thinks to play the game it will automatically move on screen. And Elon Musk said that to develop this technology it will take few more years. And the fourth project is the boring company. We all see a lot of traffic while traveling. Due to this a lot of time is wasted. So to overcome this problem he thought about a concept and that is by using tunnels to transport vehicles. So in this concept in cities they are trying to construct underground tunnels and these tunnels will connect it to the city roads and the vehicles which are on the road to take these vehicles into the underground we are using lifting machines. If a vehicle is parked on this lifting machine it will take you to the underground tunnel and from there machine will take you to your destination and again lifting machine will take you from tunnel to the road. Already they tested this so they selected a destination normally on road they started a car and through tunnel another car is started and they tested which will reach fast to the destination. The car which is on the road it takes 4 minute 44 seconds and the car which is travel under tunnel it take 1 minute 36 seconds to reach the destination. Generally to construct a tunnel it will be very expensive but Elon Musk is constructing with very less expenses only. So the way how Elon Musk thinks about the future makes him a successful man. So I hope you like my explanation. If you like this video give it a big thumbs up and share this information to all your friends and please subscribe to the channel for more interesting videos and latest information. So see you in the next video till then bye bye see you take care stay home stay safe signing off.